All praises to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Chakwadash, the by honors to the apostles and elders of Ray Millstone, Shalom, salutations to the hopeful elect that's fighting a good fight of faith and truth, in sincerity and wholeheartedly, Shalom to the Akwa, which is the women believers, Shalom to you. All praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Now, this is for those who are in the truth, we already know this. But, you know, anything that back up the scriptures, this is why we report on it, because we are in the defense of the gospel. And we are also highlighting the fact that the Lord's word is true. And we just in hell, man. But I'm allow him to speak and I'm gonna get a couple of scriptures. This video shouldn't be long at all. We wait for you to get sick and you do. Then, once you are sick, we don't restore your health. The doctor gives us a toxic pill which makes us sicker and keeps us sick. We merely manage your symptoms. So we can manage your high blood pressure, we can manage your cholesterol, we can <laughs> manage your pain, your arthritis pain, we can manage your diabetes. We don't cure you. Current health care system is a hoax. It is not a health care system. It is a disease management system. We need to have a revolution in health care. We... So you want to know who love the hospital and doctors and medicine so much? Our women, the Israelite women, man. Goodness gracious. I have never came across an Israelite woman in my 36 years of being on this earth. Every time that I, you know, whatever woman I was dealing with at the time, I never liked the hospitals before I even came into the truth. So that's spiritual. But every woman that I had, let's go to the hospital. You need to go to the hospital. You need to go to the doctor. You need to go get some medication. And our women push that shit so much. But back to the lesson at hand. This is why the scriptures call this man the devil a scripture that i'm going to eventually get but i'm gonna quote it right now they are physicians of no value because a physician is literally a healer as this man said as we already knew is i mean no is they manage why you think when you watch a commercial <laughs> i love i love um commercials when it comes to medication because i'd be cracking up i'd be like damn the side effects it's more worse than, you know, the actual, you know, disease itself. Like whatever disease that is treating the side effects is worse than that. If you take this, you may call it may cause blackouts, diarrhea, loss of sight, death. I'm like, goodness gracious. But yeah, so but they tell you in the commercials, but our people is so bugged out. You know, they believe whatever this devil presents because. Everybody that's on TV in the eyes of our people, the ones who don't have good sense, if he's on TV, he's rich, he's credible. And even though we're getting off the subject, but I'm going to bring it back to it. Let me get this real quick. <laughs> Every time a doctor or a person on, on TV or with a suit and tie on, you know, a person who got a degree, this is what this is what our people do. When a rich man speak of every man hold of his tongue and look what he said, they extol it to the clouds. But if a poor man speak, talk about the, uh, us. OK, because in the eyes of the world, we consider poor, even though we have jobs and we take care of ourselves. But we, we are considered poor in the eyes, you know, could be just a regular nine to five working individual. All right. So it says, but when the poor man speak, they say, what fellow is this? Get this nigga out of here. And if he stumble, they will help to over overthrow him so yeah so this is why the lord says see the lord made herbs for healing now the soil is defiled under this devil that's why the scripture that i always quote revelation 11 18 the lord is going to destroy them which destroy the earth so the whole earth is polluted all the herbs is polluted and they hoard it up and what they do the reason that medicine, you know, can treat you for a moment, 
because they actually do use the herbs of the earth, but then they mix it in with toxins, you know? So the reason how, the reason why you can have a headache, I mean, you can have a headache and then you take an Advil or a Tylenol and it will take away the headache is because they do use, you know, the actual herbs, but it's just mixed in with toxins. And that's why when you read on the back of whatever medication you take, you always talk about the side effects and the stuff. So basically the medicine makes you worse. As the man said, we're going to watch the video and in the video after these scriptures, we're going to watch the video again. So this is what the Lord says. Honor a physician, which is no honor in them, right? With the honor due unto him for the uses which ye may have of him, for the Lord have created him. So this is actual a real doctor. Okay, even though the, the word doctor means to falsify. If you go look it up, the word doctor, the reason I'm not going to look it up, because I'm going to make it, you know, for you to look it up. Because one thing that I realized when you talk to people, people just take your word for it. Look it up. Because if you look it up, then you will understand that the men that the Lord have sent out here to teach his word are real men of the Lord. We got a lot of people who just be saying shit. And you got a lot of people who just sheep. That's why the Lord said, you know, we are sheep. But you got a lot of people that are sheep being led astray. Believe whatever a man says. You got people who, you know, be butchering scriptures because they don't want to go into the original language of. The word. So anyways, for the most high cometh, for the most high cometh healing and he shall receive the honor of the king. The skill of the physician shall lift up his head and in the sight of great men shall he be admiration, be in admiration. The Lord have created the medicines out of the earth and he that is wise will not abhor him. So, yeah, even though we don't even have access like that. And even if you did have access to, you know, herbs. They defile, man. See, when you go into a grocery store, you will see all this GMO foods, right? But then you will see somewhere, I don't know, on the left, you will see a, um, what you would call those things, supplements. Why do you have supplements inside of a grocery store, which is literally showing you that the food that you eat in don't have no supplements in it? It don't have the mineral resources in it. It don't have the, the the vitamins and proteins that you need in it. All right. So they suck out all of that because it's genetically modified. And then they give you some supplements that's not even all the way potent. We just in hell, man. We just in hell. So now let's get to scripture. This is why the Lord called him this. But ye are forgers of lie. A forger is something that is a counterfeit. See, the medicine is brought forth as, oh, this is going to help you. But it's a counterfeit. It's an imitation of a real thing. All right. And it says ye are all physicians of no value. And the Lord told us himself what the devil have come to do. So I'm going to get that scripture. Watch the video over and in the video. The thief come if not, but for to steal and to kill and destroy. See, that's his characteristics. That's his attributes. That's what he is made for. You go into the devil, you know, now it's certain thing. Like if your ass getting, if you got shot five times, then hell yeah, you got to go to the hospital, you know. But if you got a cough. And, and trust me, I, I I had a cough. I waited it out and it went away. All right. So don't be taking these medicines, man. If, if, if you can, you know, not go. The words is not clicking right now. So that's why I'm really about to end this video. Um, My articulation is not it's not coming out the way that I want. But anyways, but yeah, if you can, um, you know, wait. If it ain't life threatening, then yeah, don't don't be taking these medicines because as the man said, which we already knew, it makes you worse. So it says, 
I am come that they may have life and that they may have it more abundantly. So, yeah, life is in your house, child. Death is in the devil. Wait for you to get sick, and you do. We wait for you to get sick, and you do. Then once... And why do we get sick? Because of the air that we breathe is polluted. The food that we eat is polluted. That's why he said we wait for you to get sick. And then what? You are sick. We don't restore your health. The doctor gives us a toxic pill which makes us sicker and keeps us sick. We merely manage your symptoms. So we can manage your high blood pressure. We can manage your cholesterol. We can manage your pain, your arthritis pain. We can manage your diabetes. We don't cure you. Current health care system is a hoax. It is not a health care system. It is a disease management system. We need to have a revolution in health care. We wait for you to get sick, and you do. Then once... So I'm going to end it on this. For your mouth utter your, your iniquity, and you choose of the tongue of the crafty, your own mouth condemneth you, and not I, yeah, your own lips testify against you. So, yeah, man, I mean, the Lord said everything that is secret should be made manifest. The Lord have made their own tongue fall upon himself. If you still want to continue to trust in this devil in any way, shape, or form, that's on you. So, all praises to Yahweh Bashim, I was shy, seek ye the Lord while he may be found. Shalom.